Peter Paul Rubens Life and Artwork. This is Peter Paul Ruben. Ruben was a Flemish painter known for his great exponent of barcode paintings. His masterpiece included portraits and landscapes. Childhood. Ruben was born June 28, 1577. His family escaped to Germany because of the difference in their religious beliefs. After studying Latin and Greek, he became a messenger. Italian period. The Italian period lasted from 1600 to 1608. During this time, he painted three altarpieces for different churches. He also decorated a high altar of Santa Marie and Vassila. Antwerp period. The Antwerp period was from 1609 to 1611. During this time, he learned his mother died while he was in Rome. In 1609, he married Isabella Brown. Around this time, he painted Rubens and his wife in the Honeysuckle Arbor. Antwerp period. After returning from Italy, his first big project was raising the cross. After raising the cross, his next project was Descent from the Cross. What art movement did Peter Paul Rubin belong to? Rubin belonged to the Barfu movement. Rubin's art emphasized movement, color, and sensuality. And Delilah. This painting was painted in 1609 for Nicholas Rocks. It was inspired by a biblical story of Samson and Delilah. It depicts m a moment when Delilah's servant is cutting Samson's hair while he is sleeping. The Honeysuckle Bower. This painting was a painting of him and his first wife. It was painted in 1609. The newlyweds are leaning towards each other, which reflects affection and devotion. The Descent from the Cross. This painting was painted for Confraternity of Aquabuvier, for Altar of Cathedral of Our Lady in Antwerp. It was finished in 1614. It depicts lowering of Christ's body from the cross. Assumption of Virgin Mary. This painting was finished in 1626. It admired in Cathedral of Our Lady in Antwerp. The upper half of the painting, while the lower part portrays Mary's empty tomb, which is surrounded by 12 disciples and three women who are to represent Mary's, Mary Magdalene and Virgin Sisters. The Origin of the Milky Way. This painting was finished in 1637, inspired by the Greco Roman myth about formation of the Milky Way, and portrays her spilling her breast milk when pulling away from baby Hercules. A view ahead seen in early mornings. This painting, this painting was finished around 1636. It is it is displayed by National Gallery. It depicts the landscapes around an artist's estate head scene near Antwerp. Hippopotamus and Crocodile. This painting shows a group of hunters and hunting dogs attacking a hippo and crocodile. It is considered one of his best works. Masquerade of Innocence. 
This painting is also inspired by a biblical story. It is located in an art gallery of Ontario, where it, where it still remains to this day. The Disembarkation at Marcellus. This painting is of the Queen of France and is portrayed disembarking a ship escorted by her sister and aunt, as well as various mythological figures who guarded her on the way to the Marcellus. Consequences of War. This painting was painted in 1639. It symbolized horrors of 30 year war. Everything in the painting was related to war and destruction. Reuben painted a self-portrait of himself in 1623. At the end of his career, he started painting pictures of himself as well as his family. Study of an old man. Reuben painted this painting in 1610. Two Sleeping Children. Reuben painted this painting in 1612.